Today, um, the service networks, except for the Air Force, have a large number of access points to the internet. And the goal of JRSS is to essentially regionalize that access into the joint regional security stacks uh, and standardize the equipment. And the output of that are going to be three things. Increased user experience, decreased ID, IT cost, as well as a increased network security. So what you have is you have an IT section with a particular company or an organization that traditionally goes out and buys that new network security appliance and they install it on the network. So you have the cost of that equipment. You also have the maintenance costs and the operational costs associated with putting that new piece of equipment on the network. Uh, within JRSS, it's a little different. Yes, you will have the initial upfront cost of buying those appliances for the JRSS stack, but you will receive significant bulk discounts associated with that. Additionally, uh, what you're able to do with the new equipment there is you're able to reduce the number of boxes in JRSS because you have that member that a large number of internet access points out there, and you're able to standardize those pieces of equipment also. And what you're able to do there is standardize the tactics, techniques, and procedures associated with the service's CNDSP responsibilities and give them the ability to manage the risk on their networks.